Hey, motherfuckers, this is Jessica White, the Dancing Outlaw, and you are watching the Redneck Minute. <laughs> now, now, this has got an interesting story, Jesse. Uh, t tell me the story of how you got this tattoo. It wasn't originally Jesus, was it? No, it's just a tattoo that looked like Jesus. I mean, originally it didn't even, it wasn't Jesus, it was something else, didn't you? You put Jesus over the top of something, didn't you? Uh, didn't yeah, you I had a cover-up. Well, what, what was it born, originally? It said, Born to be Wild. But then I had it covered this, and when my house caught a fire, the stuff from the porch dripped and burnt it. it burnt the face on it. But all I'd have to do is just get it redone and have them collar it in. And I never did go and get it done enough because then on the poor side, and all I just left it like it was, man. Right. And those aren't firecrackers, are they? <laughs> no, they're not supposed to be. supposed to be doobies. <laughs> <laughs> so, so originally it said born to be wild and had doobies, and then, and then, and then you put Jesus over top of it. But when you had the fire, Jesus got yeah. got burned. Yeah, from my house when it burnt down. Well, I lost a lot of collection in that fire house that burnt. Yeah. A lot where people got many family and friends. Yeah. I'd say it was around yeah. fifty thousand yeah. dollars worth of collection. Yeah. Everybody that sees it though thinks it's Jesus with firecrackers. I know. <laughs> do you ever tell them that it's that, or what do they? What do the people well, ask I you about that? Like lightning on each side of that, but that's the way the tattoo they put on her. Homemade, and it come out like a joint. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty cool, man. Then this one I got in Hollywood. Tom Arnold got me. That's me, Dan, and Roseanne, three right. sixes. <laughs> Is that a skull on the other one? Yeah. Guns and roses. <laughs> What's your favorite tattoo, Jesse? I like them all, really. <laughs> How many tattoos you figure you got? I don't know, never did count them. You never counted them? Uh-uh. What, 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 what are some of your favorites? Oh, well, I like this one. <clears throat> but after all, I got burnt in this one over here I like the best. What is that? It's the Grand Weaver. It costs $65, which somebody else, they probably had to pay more. Wow. A tattoo place. I'll have to take my shirt off to show you. Mm -hmm. But it's the prettiest one I got, and I love hitting one all of them. <laughs> It what, is a mine lure, baby. Where, where did you get it at? I got it up here when the tattoo shop used to be here in Madison. Wow. When I come back from Hollywood when I got it. I like it pattern the other ones. Then I've got one over here on this side. It's a little bit lower. I got a high and then I got a low. And this one's put on with a guitar string. Why the judge? Or why me judge? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what were you thinking when you got that one there? I just wanted to get a tattoo, match my other one. <laughs> what do your tattoos mean to you? They, uh, something sacred to me, because they represent something. It's hard to explain. They just, you know, cool tattoos. That's the way I like them. <laughs> I like getting one on my back again. Of what? Of something like of a, <clears throat> some kind of a, like a moth man with the wings on it. Wow. I watched that movie, man. It wasn't long after at the bridge fell in Minnesota. <laughs> they said the one goes to Mississippi to Minnesota fell. And uh, people always told me, said, you watch that movie. Said later on these things happen. I didn't give that much thought. We just watched the movie, me and my buddy. Then later on we heard on the news where that other bridge fell. Wow. And after all, this movie was made in West Virginia in Point Pleasant. This lady seen this thing in her yard. She didn't know if it was an angel from God or the devil. And she said she looked through her kitchen window and he looked like he was about seven foot tall and had wings on his shoulder. And eyes looked like they were burning. They were so bright and red. Wow. And she said it hypnotized her because it freaked her out. She never seen wow. nothing like it before. <laughs> That's why she's explaining to the guy, the magazine man, to come to do the report. And she said she didn't know if it was from God or the devil. She said, but it flipped her out. Yeah. And said later after that, Point Pleasant Bridgefield. Wow. Killed all them people. <laughs> That's something else, man. It's some sign for something. Yeah. And later that really happened. I've got the movie of it. Wow. May God be with you, brother, and don't do nothing I wouldn't.